Oh my god, you guys, I've had it. I have been sitting here trying to come up with something really creative for you guys for Labor Day, and I, I can't do it. I can't do it anymore. I am so creatively drained that I have nothing left to offer. I can't. I'm over it. I'm leaving LA. And you know where I'm gonna go? Bitch, I'm in the 212 with the fifth cop niggas. The 212, fuck your gun, do. When you're doing spray, I bet this bitch won't get a match, you won't do much. What 212 when I appear? What when I prepare? Bitch, the end of your life. Monday and you're watching Orion on Gaze of the Week. You guys, it's Labor Day! Let's start with my week last week. It was a really weird one. A, Tyler Oakley came and stayed with me. I had the best time with him. It almost felt like that movie My Week with Marilyn. Have you guys seen that? And Marilyn Monroe goes to England and this boy is like working as a PA, this hot guy. I am kind of like in a slump with everything just because you know when like one door closes and it's kind of discouraging well a lot of doors closed in my face like repetitively um and it just you know it's been rough this documentary is extremely difficult to make and i've just sort of been rolling with the punches so um i really needed like a week of of work, but also Tyler Oakley occupying my living space, I guess. So I guess it's really not like my week with Marilyn at all, except for the fact that um, it was a week. Anyway, the theme of today's video is conquer yourself, because um, I get into ruts. I get into these shitty, shitty moments where I am depressed, I don't want to do anything, life just passes me by and I feel sorry for myself, and then when you come out of it, you're like, what was I doing? What was I doing all of that time? You can cause a lot of obstacles for yourself. You have to overcome those obstacles to, to take on the real challenges. I mean, it's a lifelong process, disciplining yourself and getting to know yourself and, and making sure that you have the work ethic that you need to do what you want to do, and I've just been working on that a lot, and I just had a moment of inspiration yesterday and I'm just like, no, I'm not gonna sit here and like be lazy. I'm gonna go out and do what I need to do. So you do the same. Let's get straight to the questions. Brian and Daniel, by the way, why do all of the viewers think that y'all are breaking up? Oh, I know why. I did it, I broke them up. Just watch a little preview of tomorrow's video. This is my, my very good friend and husband. Brian. That's me. Oh, Bri. Bri, Bri, Bri. I love you. Bye, Daniel. I'm just kidding. Don't kill me, Brian and Daniel fans. P.S. Let's think of a name for them, like Braniel or Diane. I like Diane. It's kind of like Brian. Oh my god, that's my question for the week. What is Brian and Daniel's celebrity couple name? Thanks, guys. You guys asked who my newest man crush is. Well, that leads us into Wednesday's question. So, you guys, Rule is my boyfriend from the Netherlands. I know I just told you Brian was my new boyfriend, but I have one on each continent. So, if you saw Rule's video, the beginning clip was actually a moment from when we met. Here, check it out. <laughs> I'm just kidding, you guys. He's not my boyfriend. That, that's actually a clip of me waiting for pizza. Oh my god, I'm so embarrassed. No, I'm not. Rule asked how we would survive two weeks without our phone. I wouldn't. Um, kick me off the island, kill me now, just give me my phone back. And Roland! I've been expecting you, days of the week. Oh, yeah, so has everybody else. We're here every week. Do you want to hear a joke? <laughs> okay, calm down. I haven't told it yet. Alright, you know what? Never mind. You're being really weird. Why don't you just disappear into the black silhouette of yourself? <laughs> Roland, you want us to tell you some of our funniest drunken stories? Oh my god, do you have a year of time? Because I have so many. So I just want to clarify that I don't drink anymore. In fact, I'm about to approach a thousand days of not drinking. But in my day, I did drink. And um, there was one time I had a friend here in West Hollywood. I got really drunk and I was at the Abbey and I guess I didn't know how to get home. He knew the apartment complex I lived in, so he took me there. And apparently I led him all around the complex, not telling him where I lived. I guess like I got really defensive when I was drunk and I was like, I'm not telling you where I live. And I, he turned into this stranger. I took him to this guy's place that I just met and apparently I like hugged the guy and gave him a kiss on the cheek and his boyfriend was standing right there. Anyway, I was a complete mess, but it was so funny to hear about. And then finally, Miles, you didn't have a video last week, but you did make a video on your main channel about a crush you have. Miles, watch where you're going. Miles, look out! <laughs> Oh my god, uh, this is so awkward. I think the viewers know, I think everybody can tell your crush is on me, and wow, love is really in the air this week, for me especially, and 
You know, Miles, we're, we're on the same collab channel. It would get messy. You know, Brian and Daniel already have their thing, so let's just stay friends. But thank you. Wow. Ugh. All right, you guys, that's it for me. Thank you so much for watching. Have a fabulous rest of the week, and don't forget to watch the rest of the game. Okay, bye.